Hello, I'm Seth Johnson with Land the House. So, I found a spider right here. Got him about five minutes ago. And um, I'm going to be using some diatomaceous earth um, to see how long it takes for the spider to dehydrate. And I thought I would bring you along. Um, I hope to use some of this earth to uh, keep out bugs from the tiny house. So let's check it out. So here he is. Good sized little spider here. Now I don't want to put much of this in there because I want to see if just a little dose is enough to uh, to get them. Let's see what we get here. Sorry about that. So, I just sprinkled a little bit down in the bottom, and we'll see as he walks into that, is it enough to get rid of him. So the time is 5.23. We'll see how long it takes. Well, it's been 24 hours, and this guy is still quite uh, active. So what I'm going to do now is just sprinkle some of this diatomaceous earth on his body, because so far he's just been getting it on his legs. So we'll see if that works. Okay, he's been thoroughly sprinkled now, and uh, I'll give him some more time and see how long it takes. I've seen other videos where it took about an hour and a half to get a spider um, that was fully covered to um, go away, so we'll see. Well, about 12 hours after sprinkling the spider, he's dead. He was still alive three hours afterward, but um, let's see, yeah, you can see them all curled up there. But um, so I'm thinking that um, the earth on his legs probably would have gotten to him after a long time, but um, once this stuff got on his body, he was slowing down pretty quick. So it does work. Uh, thanks for watching. I'm Seth Johnson with Land a House, and I will see you next time.